Okay, boys and girls. Um, so I'm hopeful this will help you with tonight's homework. Um, the first thing we're going to look at here is how to find one tenth of three hundred. Okay. So we start with the number three hundred. And as we talked about in class today, if you're finding one tenth of three hundred, you are going to get an answer that is smaller than three hundred because one tenth uh, means we're dealing with a fraction of it. So anytime we're finding one tenth. All we do is we move our decimal one place to the left, which means we're just going to cross off the zero, and our answer is 30. So anytime you are looking to get one-tenth of something or 10 times smaller, you just move the decimal point one place back to the left, or you cross off that zero if it ends in a zero, and there's your answer. Now on the bottom, we want 10 times 300. Okay, so as we talked about earlier, uh, when something is 10 times something else, it's going to be greater, it's going to be more. So with 10 times 300, we're gonna take our decimal, we're gonna move it one place to the right and add a new zero in there. Okay, so we're just really going to add a zero on to our original number and we get 3,000. So when we're dealing with 1 tenth of something, take a zero off the end, when we're dealing with 10 times something, we add a zero onto the end. And I hope that's helpful tonight.